already bad that I cannot see you guys when talking, but I talk to you guys. If you get what I mean, what is this? like it is worse off that I would not even be able to see myself because of that. I'm not long, I'm not using my back camera. I've even, I've not even been using my back, back back camera for like three vlogs before this one. I've not been using my back camera. I'm using my front camera because. I know it's of a lesser quality but then it helps me be able to talk to you guys better i can see myself i can get create i can you know really see what you guys are going to see if you understand what i mean well i just thought to just talk about that right so guys my husband is coming today <laughs> so Tokwa is coming in today he's coming back to nigeria he's arriving in like 40 45 minutes this is currently past 11 so he's going to be landing soon and it's a cold morning like it's been raining since like 5 a.m and this is currently past 11 so but it's just drizzling right now but everybody's like really chilled and cold apologies about the noise the washing machine outside is working the ac is on so i'm sure there's a lot of background noise in this video apologies for that so i'm heading now to the airport to get him i'm super excited i'm sure you can tell i'm in a good good mood i'm super excited to go get him and then um we would come home let's go besties how are you guys doing so yesterday was the way keeping guys i could not attend like after we left the airport we went to get food we came back to the house guys i couldn't even stand up i don't know i have been feeling feverish you know, sort of even before Sokwe arrived yesterday but i think i i was just really down yesterday and because of that i couldn't even go for the way keeping so he was the only one that went and but this morning i feel a whole lot better and i feel like i need to attend the the burial yes i need to attend the burial it's important that i attend the burial <laughs> so i just need to get ready the burial is for 10 a.m this morning and it's happening in a church so i need to get ready this is almost 8 a.m so i pretty much have like one hour 30 minutes i need to leave the house like 30 minutes before the time i don't want to be late to a burial <laughs> yeah so i'm just going to get ready and when i say get ready i mean just have my baths do slight makeup i don't want to do anything too much right and then i'm going to do slight makeup and then tie my ghillie guys i've never tied my ghillie before i really don't know how that is going to go for me and i didn't want to incur any unnecessary spending by getting a gilly artist or a makeup artist or all of that stuff that i would normally do right but this one is just a barrier i feel like it's just something small i don't need to spend money so i'll maybe just watch one or two youtube videos and see how i'm going to tie that gilly i don't know how it's going to come out honestly i've never tied a gilly before and if not i'm just going to go to the church with the gilly and probably top his mom will tie for me or somebody will just tie for me because the church you have to cover your hair right so yeah and it was painful to me that i didn't attend the wake pain yesterday because i didn't then get to wear my i didn't then get to wear my white boo boo that i that i made which is so beautiful when i tried it on at the taylor's place i really loved it but i wear it some other time and also because at the wake keeping is where people come and say different things about the person about the diseased right they come and start saying how the person was you know 
say nice stuff or good stuff whatever right but anyways i missed that already so i have to be there today um talk by stepped out this morning guys <laughs> the airline did not his bag did not come yesterday so when we picked him up he checked in two boxes and had one um, car, um carry on luggage and at the point of landing he could only find one of his boxes out of the two so he went to meet them and they said oh the other box did not come i'm like what the hell the other box did not come and they told him it was going to come with another flight so this morning as early as i think 6 30 or to 7 he already called the airline and they told him that the second box has arrived so now so now he has to he had to go back to the airport he has gone already safe he has to go back to the airport to go and pick up the second box i don't know why people do uh, well i think it happened like that because it was a connecting flight so it didn't come with a straight flight he had to go one country to the other join another airline to, you know yeah probably that's why that happened right so but anyways let's go and get ready i have one hour there about to get ready so i need to be quick about it um get my makeup done and let's see the drama we're going to do with that gilly i'll try my best i'll really really try my best all right and let me show you guys some of the goodies 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 that Tucker brought um i just had to select these few ones out of the whole lot of goodies that it came with like it came with so many goodies when i say goodies chop chop chocolates cookies biscuits all of the good stuff right goodies 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 this is potato chips right this one is um um milk chocolates biscuits way fast this is way fast um this is smarties yeah this is um sugar free fiber biscuits um this is caramel chocolates nice i think i'm going to like i'm going to really like this one i love caramel a whole lot um this is cranberry cookies i love cookies as well this is brownie cookies brownie cookies girl i don't think i don't think it's a brownie brownie but i think it's just the brand so this is brownie cookies and this is shortbread i love shortbread as well and they are the smaller sizes like mini shortbread so it's like it comes like the size of, of a chin chin do you get yeah okay so let's go and get ready <music> here at the church for the burial and honestly i attempted to do that gilly but it was not working it wasn't working at all so i'll probably just look for a makeup studio where i can quickly get the gilly done or talk is trying to help me see if one of the aunties can help me out with the mm -hmm. gilly here because the church i won't be able to enter without covering my hair right honestly gilly artists is right now i know the kind of work that they do i opened one youtube um, tutorial on how to tie the gilly and i was like what you got to have pins you have need to you need to have somebody to hold it for you do some pleating arrange the steps like it's a lot of work i did not even bother to even stress myself about it so um let's see if one of the aunties can help me out or if i just have to look for um a nearby gilly artist that can tie for me
It's nice. It's nice. One thousand naira gili, babe. <laughs> Are you for real? Yeah. One thousand naira gili. because it was a burial and mm, you know i just felt like it's going to be insensitive of me to start vlogging at a burial where people are crying getting emotional and all so i didn't even bother vlogging but we thank god it went really well um, I think that's the first burial I'm attending as, as an adult. Yes, I was at my mom's burial. If you don't know, my mom is late. Um, but then I was just about seven, eight years old. So I think at that time, I didn't really know. <laughs> I knew what was going on anyway, but I wasn't very clear <laughs> on what was happening. So this is like my very first burial, official first burial that I'm attending as an adult. And then from the church, we went to the cemetery. <laughs> Guys, it's just the same way Saturdays, you see weddings happening everywhere, right? Not the same way it was like everybody <laughs> was burying dead body yesterday. See different families at the graveyard, you know, everybody's bringing one dead body or the other i just got thinking you know if just in that one cemetery maybe they were burying like let's even say 10 which is good more than 10 because they do like the old day from morning to nine so let's even say 50 right it was a very big cemetery and that's just one cemetery in lagos and in lagos you can have maybe let's say like a 10 or 15 or 20 cemeteries and then we have cemeteries in the 36 states across nigeria so you can imagine how many people die every day i mean and these are people that they are burying in cemeteries or not the one they are burying in their houses or going to their villages to bury them or burying them in their you know and more we thank god you know at the end of the day this life we just need to make sure that we live our best life at the end of the day because now the barrier is over everybody has gone back life continues people had breakfast this morning people would go about their business you know children will go back to school the parent, the siblings will go back to work person has gone so please live your life for yourself at the end of the day don't leave it for anybody do you do what makes you happy your happiness is the goal stop trying to please people because at the end of the day you're on your own. I was even telling Tokwe yesterday when we got back that now we have all left him. He's alone in a dark place. He cannot move, he cannot do anything. We've all nobody stayed and said, Oh, my brother, I need to stay with him, or my father, I, need to, I can't leave him here. You have to leave at the end of the day, you know. Anyways, so today we are heading out. We are going for a dinner with top siblings and um i'm just getting ready i'm not doing any makeup i'm just going to do something really light <music>
let me enter the car i start the car as though i'm the one driving oh my days jeez oh. oh. it's freaking hot Me that I seriously hate to drive, like I totally hate it. I hate driving. I prefer being the passenger princess, you know. Period. But I think I look good. I look really good. I love it. And I'm wearing these sneakers and a black pants. My husband is yet going to kick me out of this place. She will better drive. <laughs> Move, Jerry. If I want to drive us today. Mmm. Okay, okay. Let me go to my position. This is my favorite song at the moment. Hey. You're beautiful from air to toe. Hey. Ooh, it's here and we are already at their house so i'm just gonna step out now and we are gonna go in to say hello to the new baby but i may not be able to vlog you guys already know i don't vlog in people's houses so but let's see let's see let's see 